The much-anticipated inaugural season for the Goshen Bowling Team has finally arrived. The men's and women's teams open their season at the Dirty Bird Classic, Saturday, September 8th, hosted by Concordia University. Both the men's and women's teams expected a lot from themselves, but no one was more ready to go than Rebecca Music. So I went into the tournament wanting to be on all-tournament team, but I also went in just with the mindset to make good shots. Music reached her goal of being on the all-tournament team as well as being the best female bowler in the tourney. She took first place in the women's competition with a total of 599 pins and helped lead the team to a fourth place finish out of the 14 teams that were there. Head coach Scott Curtis reflects on why Music is starting off on the right foot. And she ended up being one of the dream team kids, which in Michigan is the top eight best male and female athletes in the state as seniors. Coach Curtis has full faith in his teams as their season is off to a great start with the women finishing 4th out of 14 and the men finishing 12th out of 15 in their opening tourney. Coach Curtis has high expectations for the season. When we start our conference play in December um, and we walk in there, we will be so prepped and ready to just take it to them. Don't be surprised if we walk out of there with some hardware. Both the men's and women's teams will travel to Milwaukee, Wisconsin for the Midwest Collegiate Championship beginning Saturday, October 5th and ending Sunday, October 6th. Both teams look to continue their success as they prove they are a force to be reckoned with. But as far as the Crossroads League, we are not going to be somebody that, oh yeah, they're the new kid on the block. Think that way because then we'll just run you over. For Globe Sports, I'm Joey P.